Hello, we're back for another video on the Arc Field and Map. Today I'm going to be showing you the best way to tame a high level Shadow Main on one times taming. First thing you'll need to do is get your fish on. So the first thing you need to do is craft yourself some fish baskets. If you just select the aberration icon, you can craft fish baskets at level 13. All you need is fibre, fungal wood and thatch. I recommend crafting quite a few, so the larger the fish the better. For example, this fish is a huge one. This is the kind of fish you're looking for. This is a 1.8. Place your fish basket down. Wait for him to come in range so we can catch it. There you go. And what I like to do now is you need to release your fish into the wild and then you cryopod it. Stick them all in the cryopod, stick them in the fridge ready to go. And that's how you can collect a lot of good fish. This way you won't have to worry about spoil timers or catching any fish while trying to tame the shadow main. And once you're ready to tame, all you have to do is just throw them back out of the cryopod and recapture them in your fish baskets ready to feed to your shadow main. Ideally you're looking at fish the size of 1.5 or over to be able to get the most taming efficiency as the larger the fish the more the taming bar will go up every time it eats. I'd recommend capturing at least 20 to 25 fish and if you are on better rates than one times taming you won't need as many and you probably won't need to focus on getting as large fish as possible. So shadow mains only spawn in Asgard you can reach this by the teleportation menu on your survivor. Teleport into Asgard southeast will be the quickest way to get you to the shadow main spawn location so if we just fly up from here just on the other side of this mountain here is where the shadow mains will spawn there are two areas where they will spawn they're both purple tree areas like this this is the first one the other one is on the other side of that pointy mountain there but I've found that this is the better spawn location for them. 63.8 latitude, 45.3 longitude. And here's our location on the map. Obviously that's not Asgard, but that's where you want to be heading if you are in Asgard looking at the map. And they spawn all around these purple trees, basically. There we go, we found some in here. Pack of three just down there. All by the portal room located here at 40.5 latitude, 57.5 longitude. Location on the map. And you just want to go into the center portal, which will take you to Asgard. And once in Asgard, from the terminal, you want to head southeast from this direction to get you to the Shadow Main spawn location. So once you have captured enough fish, we need a Desmodus because that's the only flying team you can have in the realms. A nice supply of fish baskets so you can recapture your fish after throwing them out the cryopods. I'd recommend bringing Gilly Armor. Enough blood packs to make the Sanguine Alexa consumable as that will boost the taming process by 30% once consumed from your hotbar near the creature. Crossbow and grappling hooks. A decent shotgun with at least 200 rounds so you can take care of the other shadow mains in the area. Once you have located the shadow main you want to tame, you want to place down a trap nearby. All you need is four stone foundations, two by two, 16 walls, two high on each side of the box. Once you have your trap down, what you want to do is kill off his mates so you only have the shadow main you want to tame. So we got a 140 here, we're going to tame this boy. I would recommend killing all wild creatures nearby just so it doesn't aggro on any of those. Set your Desmodus to high follow distance. You're ready to lure him in. I recommend doing it in the daytime because they aren't as strong. What I like to do is position the Desmodus just in front of the trap as when he uses his teleport attack on you he's going to be using some momentum. Dismount. Use parachute and then you just want to grapple up to your Desmodus and hang basically as bait in front of your trap. Get the Shadow Man's attention and then he should fall into the trap pretty easily. You then you just want to fly out around the distance so he stops attacking. He will then fall back to sleep. They can only be tamed when they are asleep. They sleep in the daytime so you want to be trying to aim to start trapping one probably about 6am. Because that gives you enough time to trap it and get ready to tame it. A decent time in the day. Now it's time to equip that ghillie armor. Once you have it trapped that is the hard part done. All you have to do now is whack your fish baskets down in the water and then throw your fish out your cryopods and recapture them again and make sure you have your filled fish basket in your last quick slot to feed it through the wall. Then you just have to rinse and repeat this process until it's fully tamed. It's really just clear sailing from here. I was not able to catch enough 1.5 weight fishes or over, so I wasn't able to get 100% taming effectiveness. It was very close though. 
At around 24% taming progress, I decided to craft the potion in the Desmodus inventory, Sanguine Elixir. Pull it into one of your hotbar quick slots and consume it while being next to the shadow main looking at him and boosted my taming progress up to 54%. We tamed ours at about 95% efficiency so it gained about 66 levels which isn't too bad considering which is almost a perfect tame. Not quite but it would have been perfect if we actually had more heavier fish to feed it. And that is how you will perfect tame a shadow main. Just make sure you get all those high weight fish. 1.8 or over is ideal. Store them up in your cryophrodes, get at least 15 to 20 of those and you are set to perfect tame yourself a shadow main. Hope the video is helpful to you, I'll catch you all in the next one. Take care, goodbye.